Have you found any food in the city that rivals barbecue and chicken? <laughs> Uh, everyone loves barbed and chicken. Uh, I'm not really too much of a big fan of the barbed and chicken, really? even though it's, it's pretty famous uh, in barbed and. But uh, the food here is great. Um, here in the facility with the Steelers chefs cooking for us every day, so it's, it's very good. Key, what attracts you about Pitt's defense the way that they want you to play the linebacker? Uh, the way they just fly around. Uh, this defense blitzes, they get TFLs and sacks. Um, Coach Manny kind of compared me to Dennis uh, that played here about two years ago. Uh, the way he just flies around, uh, some he kind of seen in me, um, some I've watched film over him about, and uh, just I think I can mock him a little bit and, and play that role for uh, this defense coming up next year. How much did Coach Manilak uh, personally uh, impact your decision to come here? Yeah, uh, he was a big, big factor. Um, he was one of the first coaches to reach out um, once I hit the portal, um, had breakfast together, and uh, talked a little bit about the defense. Um, and and he just a, he's a great dude. He knows football. He's been at the top level somewhere, somewhere I want to get one day. Um, so, yeah, he was a big impact on me. What was your main motivation for going into the portal? Um, just play at a bigger level. Um, I've been at OU since 2015 or 2018, um, playing five, six years there. So, um, just coming to a power five level, get my name out there a little bit more so I can ultimately reach the next goal, which is the NFL. Right, a number of transfers have done similar things. Did you also notice that? Is that something you studied about the Pitt program? Yeah, yeah. I mean, I know uh, Simmons, backer here uh, last year, he was a transfer, came in, uh, did a tremendous job, um, learned the defense pretty well, talked to him when I came down, um, first day I got down here, so yeah. You're a seventh year guy. What's it been like seeing how the transport has changed from when you came into college to where it is? Yeah, uh, it, it's it's definitely crazy. Um, there's the pros pros and cons to it. Um, in my situation, I'm a graduate, so I think it was a it was a pro for me. Um, the the kind of obvious decision to, to make um, of hitting the portal and, and seeing where I can go. Where do you see yourself? Middle linebacker or on the outside? Middle linebacker. Yeah. Yeah, um, I've learned all the base defense. Um, some of the other packages that are in a third down uh, type of scenario, I'm still kind of trying to get a hold of. But uh, I played uh, with Coach Burrow, Joe Burrow's father, um, under this defense, basically the same type of defense for about two, three years. So kind of familiar with it. Yeah, I would be found Coach Narduzzi. Uh, he's, he's a stand-up dude. Um, he's a great coach, uh, defensive-minded coach, um, some I, I wanted to step into. Um, and he's he's going to tell you how it is, and, and that's a coach I really embrace and someone I want to be under. It's a younger, I mean, there's there's younger guys in the linebacker room. I mean, I feel like they kind of turned over in the last year or two. Do you feel like the old guy? Oh, yeah, him. most most definitely. A lot of young guys in there, me and Brandon and uh, Solomon are the old guys in there. So uh, we just try to preach to them every day and keep everyone on the uh, same page and, and make sure that room is, is good. Is there a sense of urgency in this show? Did that create a sense of urgency? Uh, yeah, most definitely. Um, obviously, this is my last year, so just coming in, I just want to make an impact. I'm just trying to come in and, and really learn the defense, hone in, and uh, kind of just be a leader to to everyone and um, see what I can do.